Didas Pahalwe, Garu Mahindra Rajapaksa Jana. When Mahindra Rajapaksa handed over the government in 2015, the total debt of the country stood at 2 trillion. Today, it has increased up to 21 trillion. Although you are seated on the speaker's chair, you have been mortgaged for 950,000 rupees. If there are five members in your family, the total mortgage is 4.7 million. Even a monk has been mortgaged in the country. The cardinal has also been mortgaged. Even a person working in the parliament has also been mortgaged for 950,000 rupees. Many people raised their voice over the Hambanto report. I was removed from the cabinet when Ranil Vikramasinghe tried to give it away to China. Today, I am very happy because I was not part of the betrayal that has resulted in a curse to the country. At that time, Rani Vikram Singh assumed that I would halt my political journey after being removed from the cabinet. But I challenged him. I said that the United National Party, that once produced the father of the nation, would be wiped out because of what he did. I didn't do anything alone, but did the people do that? That is a good message to any political leader, minister or parliamentarian who tries to betray the country. Charita Herat told Parliament that a person who has not even seen a Sri Lankan Airlines flight has to be part of paying 17,000 rupees because of the damages caused by that company. It was the Parliament that passed laws on the Kalamba port city allowing large businesses to be set up. Foreigners will now come here and run operations efficiently. All the profits that they earn will go to China and their profits from the Hamant report. All those profits are received by China. Therefore, how can we reduce our budget deficit? We have to beg from China to reduce the budget deficit. What has happened to our country? We have sold the heart of our country to China and lungs of our country to the US. At midnight, a secret deal was signed to give it away. Now they are trying to sell away more assets that are important to us. Can the country improve if this happens? Why have the people elected 225 representatives to parliament? During the election, what did we all vociferously campaign for? That was to regain control of the Hammanta report and ensure that even an inch of our land would not be given away. Mahindra Rajapaksa kissed the ground and said that his first, second and third priorities are the country. The people voted for him out of love. Today, even his heart might be disturbed as nothing that was told has happened. Today, we do not own anything. Everything is being sold off gradually. The next is an election. It can be a presidential election or a parliamentary election. An election is held to seek the mandate of the people. We will face the next election seeking a mandate to recover the assets such as the Hamantura port and the Kalamba port city that was sold through secret agreements by obtaining commissions. <laughs>